Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down MTGO with our popper slivers. Let's do this. We won the die roll. Oh, that's a lot of land. That's a lot of land for one sliver hand. We're going to mulligan. Ah, uh, this isn't great either, but we'll keep it. We'll keep. We don't need that right now. Uh, let's start with the Blossoming, see what our opponent's playing, and then we can drop our Sidewinder and Viberlint next turn. Hmm, burn? Passing straight back to us. Which tells me maybe we're against burn here. Hmm. We'll just drop them both out, see what happens. If either of these dies, I'm not too worried about it, because if we are up against burn, flanking isn't that crazy. Poisonous is still pretty slow against burn. So we'll just pass the turn and hope to draw into some lords that we can start protecting with vines. We've got Journey to Nowhere if they start playing any of their creatures that we'll need to take care of. They're Malachimus, that's uh, something that's going to get journeyed, 100%. No, thank you. That thing will kill us very quickly. All right, well. Let's journey this sucker. Ping us for one before it goes away. Taking your guy. All right. Now we got vines up. Don't know if it's best to use uh, use protection on any of these guys, just in case we want to hold it up for a lord if we draw into one. We'll see. Getting that Thermal Alchemist off was important, though. They got another one. Alright. Nothing we can really do about that. But they take the extra turn. It looks like they're stuck on two mana right now. Ugh. Yucky. That is... Not exactly ideal. Still attack in. See if they do any blocks here. They are going to block. All right, perfect. So, it's time to cast with the kicker on this thing. Let's get this thermal alchemist off. Do not want the Thermal Alchemist on the board. No, thank you. We're running out of creatures, though. So they could start burning our creatures out. Uh, and it won't be pretty. Good use of our Vines of Astwood, though, in my opinion. Leave the Stampede would be nice here so we can start refilling our hand. Because our creatures are going to start dying quick, I feel like. Don't tell me they got another one. 
Searing Blaze. All right. No more Viverlit. That's fine. Give me a Lord. I want Metallic. Ah, that is terrible. All right. Well, we're going to keep uh, the land in our hand right now just to represent something. We are not moving fast enough against Burn, though. Definitely not. Let me attack. There we go. I don't think this deck has won against Burn. It's a very hard matchup for us. Okay, just gonna be burning me out now. Oh my gosh, are you serious? That is not helpful, man. This is what I'm talking about. This is not good. We could be swinging in for so much more. They can they can hurt us a lot faster than we can hurt them right now. Especially if they get a third land. Just gonna go to my face. Yep. Clock is on. It's real. Just draw a card. See if they get. Nope. They're still stuck on two. And we're flooded out. Oh my gosh, dude. It's crazy. See, if we hadn't taken care of those Thermal Alchemists, though, this game would be over already. We would be dead. But three damage a turn is not going to cut it against them. Not with five cards in hand. If they had less cards, we could we could pull pull something out here, but they got five cards still. They can just keep burning us, burning us, burning us, burning us. Their clock is faster. Rift Bolt. Yep. No, I don't have the means to pay for that. There's our lord. Oh my goodness, man. It's about time. Now we got a clock. Fortunately, we don't have protection for it. So our clock is very limited, but we can swing in for six. While we can. I'm thinking about cutting Metallic completely from the deck for something else, something more relevant. I already took some out, but we could be dead here. Oh, one lava spike and we're out. They got the third mountain. Let's see. Just gonna yield through this turn. All right, curse of the pierce, pierced heart is not gonna. Oh well, that'll do it. Okay. Well, yep. That'll end the game right there. Let's go to game two against Burn. Oh. All right, Armadillo Cloak, you're in. Uh, natural State, yeah, we'll bring in one of those. Uh, we'll bring in Hollow. Take out Metallic. We'll take out Sidewinders. take out uh, uh, maybe we'll bring in both our natural state nah Sunlance actually will be good. So let's take out all our sidewinders. Flanking is just not going to be super effective here. And spinneret. 
Spinneret can go. Okay. Uh, I think this is alright. Maybe we could have cut one journey. But I think this is alright. This is a tough hand to keep. We can just play our Lord. I don't know if this is going to cut it. We've got Armadillo Cloak, though. I think I want to keep it for Armadillo Cloak. If we can get that on a creature, get it out of range of stuff, I think we'll be in better shape. Fortunately, they can probably hit us pretty fast here. Burn is the bane of my existence in this matchup. In the popper. So we get a Viverlens. We'll put it out there. Give us an extra turn to draw into some more mana, hopefully. If it dies, it dies. Uh, I'd rather keep the vines up for our lord. Alright, so now we got two lords, uh, which is nice, but pretty sure one of these is going to die. But if it does, we got a backup one. So we'll see what happens. Maybe this wasn't the correct hand to keep. Maybe we should have mulliganed. that go through, which means uh, we're not trying to take out our guy just yet. Probably more worried. Usually Burn's more worried about just going to face. Less about the creatures unless you're in lethal distance. And then they'll start taking them out. So, maybe it's alright that we're tapping out for now. If we can draw into a land next turn, that'd be excellent. We'll go Muscle Sliver, hold up Vines, and then the turn after we'll do Armadillo Cloak on something. Just pass them back to me. Oh, well, we got our land, but it's coming in tapped. We're tapped out. Let's put another Lord down. We can at least swing in here. Doubt they will block with Thermal Alchemist. But they're going to start chaining next turn. Okay. Our life total's still at 20. It's good. It's good. If they tap out here, we're in the clear for Armadillo Cloak, and that'd be excellent. If they don't tap out, Searing Blaze... Okay. So we'll lose one. We got another armadillo cloak. Which is excellent. So let's...
Let's start getting our guy out of range of all their stuff. Lava Spike will still do it here. But we... We gotta hope they don't have it, basically. Uh, yeah, sure. Doesn't matter. I don't care how these go on the stack. Gaining some life back, which is good. Very good. We're at their mercy, though. It'd be nice if we could get another land here. If we had drawn another land, it would have been excellent, because then we could have Vines back up, have one Armadillo Cloak on the Muscle Sliver. But if we can get a Plated out, that would be very nice, because we can get past Lava Spike. And bring me down. Still got six cards in their hand, too. They could, uh, Lightning Bolt and then Gut Shot, too. On the Lord. Yeah. So it looks like that's what they're going to try to do here. Oh, it comes back to us. Okay, so now we're in an interesting spot. Uh, we're going to... We're going to journey. Gonna journey with Vine's backup. Alright, game three, here we go. They can't get out of that. Uh, yeah, I'm happy with this. Let's go back into it. See if we can't pull off our first win against Burn. That'd be nice. That'd be really nice. Our McDillo Cloak doing some work, showing its strength. Um, we'll keep this. It's again unfortunate we don't have a turn turn one play. But we are in the draw. So there could be a chance still. Okay, well, there we go. Uh, we'll try it. We'll see if it stays out. We gotta try to get our guys out of out of range of some stuff, so... Uh, you'll through this turn. Start dropping lords. Thermal alchemist, possibly. A spike to me. The lava spike only deals three damage. I don't know why I was so worried about that. I think I was confusing it with the card that deals four damage. I don't know why I was so worried. Other planes. Drop our muscle. Let's 
See if this guy survives. Nope, not gonna. That's okay. We've got we've got other lords to fill back in. I might even wait to play both our lords at once. Maybe that's silly, but we'll see what our draw is. If our draw if our draw is a vines of asswood, I'll play a lord, keep it out, go through this turn. Yeah, I was confusing lava spike for a different card. Okay. I think we drop uh, our Riverlands and our Lord here. Start getting some poison on. Will our Lord survive? Looks like it will for now. Thermo Alchemist, alright. So it begins. Vines, yes, okay, perfect. That is excellent. All right, we got our work cut out for us. We're still uh, in a lot of danger here of death. But the vines is gonna be very helpful. We're lucky they drew into their Thermal Alchemist pretty late in the game. Fire Blast. On our Viverlands, huh? I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Still get in for six here. We might have to take a turn off next turn just to do lead the stampede, refill our hand holding up uh, vines. But I think we're looking to be in pretty good shape. Nope, we're just going to play a Lord. Can we win here? We can actually win here. Potentially. I think we got it. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. I think we got it. We can kick vines if they try to take anything out. Just give something hexproof and swing in for everything. They're gonna go to my face. Okay, we win. We got it. Awesome. <laughs> First win against burn. Finally. Woo. Woo. That's tough. That's tough. That's a tough matchup. <laughs> but we did it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Make sure to subscribe for more sliver popper content. We will see you guys in the next video. And yeah, we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks.